Welcome to Storytime with Miss Melange. My name is Jenny, and the next book that we're going to read is Where Are You From? by Yamil Mendez. Where are you from? Where are you from? They ask. Is your mom from here? Is your dad from there? They ask. I'm from here, from today. Same as everyone else, I say. No. Where are you really from? They insist. I ask Abuelo because he knows everything. And like me, he looks like he doesn't belong. Where am I from? Abuelo thinks his eyes squint like he's looking inside his heart for an answer. You are from the Pampas, the open free land, he says. You're from the Guacho, brave and strong. From the brown river that cleanses and feeds the land, that gives us grain for our bread, the milk from the cows. You're from the mountains so high, they tickle Senor Cielo's belly, where the condor whoops his family and the dragoir prowls the night. But you're also from the warm blue oceans the copper warriors try to tame. And the elegant palm trees stretch their fingers to caress. You're from the hurricanes and dark storms and a tiny singing frog that calls the island people home when the sun goes to sleep. From this land where our ancestors built a home for all, even when they were in chains because of the color of their skin. You're from the grandmothers who search for their grandchildren waiting and always waiting in the plaza, their white handkerchiefs wrapping the sorrow of their thoughts. You come from the sunshine that lights our path in this world and the rain that washes away our mistakes. But Abuelo, I ask, where am I really from? Abuelo laughs, you want a place? He points to his heart from my love and the love of all those before us. From those who dreamed of you because of a song sung under the Southern Cross, or the words in a book written under the light of the North Star. You, you are from all of us. I am. And that is the end of Where Are You From? And so I loved how her grandfather answered that question, right? So creative. So consider where are you from? And try not to think of the traditional answer, but think about your culture and how that makes you unique. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe so that you can be notified of new stories. Thanks for watching. Bye.